Hello everyone, welcome to Infigyan in this very exciting video of exponential equation. Equation is 4 power x minus 3 power x equal to 7. So we will see two approaches today. First one is using calculus. We will talk about end behavior of the function or exponent or exponentials. And second method is purely mathematical that is using algebra. We will find out the solution part. So let's get started. If you are thinking that you will take log, so if you will take log, then log a minus b is not there. a minus b, then you have to write there minus log 1 over a plus 1 over b. That will come again and again. So using log, it is little tough to evaluate. So what I am going to show you, see first approach is using calculus and then we will solve using algebra purely calculation. So let's start by considering minus 3 raised to the power x towards right. So 4 power x is equal to 3 power x plus 7. Now divide both sides by 4 raised to the power x. So 4 raised to the power x over 4 raised to the power x equal to 3 raised to the power x over 4 raised to the power x plus 7, 7 times 1 upon 4 raised to the power x. Okay, so left side will become 1. Right side, see how, see this is simple 3 power x over 4 power x because your exponent is same we will merge it base. So it will come out like this. And 1 over 4 power x, I will write 1 power x over 4 power x. So it is 1 over 4 power x. Otherwise also you can write 4 raised to the power minus x also. So let me write 3 over 4 whole power x plus 7 times 1 over 4 whole power x. Okay. Now see the observation from this equation. We will conclude that 3 over 4, let me write here, it is lying in between 0 and 1. 1 over 4, it is also lying in between 0 and 1. Now let's talk about the graph of exponential function. I am considering the graph of a raised to the power x. If a is greater than 1, then your graph is monotonic increasing. Similarly, if your a lies between 0 and 1, then your graph would be monotonic decreasing. Once you raise x from minus infinity to plus infinity, graph would be monotonic decreasing. Let me show you by one example. If suppose this is 1 over 4 power x. So it is basically 4 raised to the power minus x also you can write. Or if I am putting x very big number, suppose x is 10,000 or more than that, then 1 over 4 raised to the power, so number will becoming smaller, smaller and smaller. So that value will tend to 0. That is why function would be decreasing. Okay, now conclusion from this. Let us write this equation again. 1 equal to 3 over 4 whole power x plus 7 times 1 over 4 whole power x. See left hand side is constant function. Right hand side is monotonic decreasing plus 7 times monotonic decreasing. It will be decreasing with rapid rate faster. So overall what is coming out the function which is right hand side is monotonic decreasing. Now you can see one function is there which is monotonic decreasing and another function is there which is constant. This is constant x equal to 1 or you can consider y is equal to 1 and this is monotonic decreasing function. So what is conclusion? it will give you only one point intersection. At most one point intersection would be there. So it is confirmed that only one solution is there. 
okay so let's find out that method is called guess and check method so i am using that guess and check method x equal to 1 so 4 minus 3 equal to 7 no x equal to 2 16 minus 9 equal to 7 yes so our answer is x equal to 2 using analytical means we conclude something over his statements and then we come to know that only one solution is there so let's find out so that method is called guess and check method by that method you are getting x equal to 2 now come to algebraic solution which is more interesting i will write 4 raised to the power x as 4 raised to the power x over 2 whole square minus 3 raised to the power x over 2 whole square your lhs how it is possible because we know that a power b power c can be written as a power bc so i use that exponent property by that property i can write 4 power x over 2 whole power 2 once i will multiply it will come out 4 power x okay now difference of a square formula a square minus b square we know a plus b a minus b so i will write before that you should consider this is a this is b so you can avoid that rewriting so it will be a plus b and a minus b i will write okay as we know 7 is prime number so we can factorize this 7 as 1 times 7 and 7 times 1 that means we are 1 and 7 and 7 and 1 as you can see a what we have considered 4 power x over 2 which is always positive exponential b 3 raised to the power x over 2 always positive so one strong point we can reject immediately the first possible combination this would be rejected how you can see the difference of two positive numbers, you can see it is 7 and the sum of two positive number is smaller. Is it not possible? If both numbers are positive, then sum would be greater always. So this would be the first case would be rejected. So what is left? That is 7 times 1. 7 is prime number, so only this much factorization you can do. Now let me write a plus b equal to 7 a minus b equal to 1 add once you will add 2a will be 8 a will be 4 subtract or you can re means put the value of a in any of the equation or i can use subtraction also then 2b a will be cancelled out b minus of minus b so 2b equal to 6 7 minus 1 6 B will be equal to 3. So what is a? 4 raised to the power x over 2 is equal to a equal to 4. 4 means 4 raised to the power 1. So x over 2 you will compare its exponent because base is same 1. So x will be 2. Similarly for b I will write 3 power x over 2 is equal to b equal to 3 so x over 2 will be equal to 1 3 raised to the power 1 it is so x will be equal to 2 so from this method also we have got the same result x is equal to 2 is our solution now let's check verify the result also verification x equal to 2 put their value 4 power 2 minus 3 power 2 which is your left hand side 16 minus 9 7 and that is your rhs 
hence verified so your final result becomes x equal to 2 is the only solution for the given equation exponential equation thank you so much for watching i hope today you like this video please subscribe my channel and give like impression also thanks a lot